today today gang we are going to talk about capsule wardrobes we're getting to that time of summer when you need to rely on those absolute essentials things are picking up i've talked to so many women over the past couple weeks who keep saying like i just can't get it together i feel like things are crazy and i'm going in a million directions and we're all trying to adjust to a new summer schedule and getting dressed Ugh, no time for it to be hard, right? So let's put together some great pieces that are gonna get you through the summer, that do all the things, super versatile, super easy. So you can take that one thing right off your plate and we can take care of all the other things that are heading our way. So, summer capsule, what is it? Well, it's a mix and match group of pieces that you can kind of throw together in a flash. You can bring it on a trip if you need to, long weekend getaway, up to the cottage, up to the cabin, or just when you're running around. So I've got some of my absolute favorite pieces here that are gonna do all the things for you. And the best part is we're kind of sticking with the color palette. So I think that is one of the most important ways to start your capsule wardrobe. I also recommend packing that way. Pick a palette and stick with it. So when it comes to capsule wardrobe, kind of pick your palette. So what we're doing today is we're doing a little bit of denim blue, little bit of navy, some khakis, some creams, and some neutrals. We're gonna make it real, real easy. When I'm packing, one thing I do try to think about a bit is sticking with one neutral, one dark neutral or the other. So I either go black or navy, but I rarely do both unless all the other pieces work with that one standout piece. So, dresses. Let's begin with this guy. This is from Michael Stars. This is the Delilah dress. This is what hot summer dreams are made of. This guy barely touches your body. It is so light, a linen. It's meant to look lived in. So get rid of that steamer. Throw away that iron. You don't need it for this guy. It is so darn comfortable. And yes, it does have pockets. I love it because it's got a little bit higher neckline. I like that it's just a slight, slight, slight cutaway here in the tank. So not so much you can't wear your normal bra with it, but just enough that it gives a little bit of a feminine silhouette. Now, I think this guy runs a little generous. I popped on a small, mm, I think I might go down a size. Sometimes in shifts, I just think you got to try both and for me i think the bust might i think there's enough room here that i could go down a size if not though you don't want it pulling the secret sauce of this guy is that it's not touching the bod right so nice and cool couple other options in that same category this guy just came in this is from Faraday. i'm going to give you the name of this guy because i was the phoenix dress now same idea but if you want something with a little bit more arm coverage this guy's gonna fit very much in the same way, away from the body, so a little bit of a looser fit. You've got this beautiful square neckline, so I love this dress if you are curvy around top because it opens up your neckline, shows off your curves, but doesn't pull. Sometimes when you're curvy and you're wearing that higher neckline, it just feels like a whole lot of material up here. And then that great puff sleeve. This is another one that I do think runs generous. So I will go down a size in this Phoenix dress from Faraday as well. Note here color, right? So we're introducing some of our colors. This is a great wash down kind of dark chambray blue and a base of more of a creamy white. Okay, now we know that when you've got this great little shift dress on, maybe you're popping from outside to inside and you need a really great layer. So this is when I look to two different layers. The first, a lightweight summer cardigan. Sometimes it feels like a sweater in summer is an oxymoron. I find it's not. I love having a good kind of beachy cardigan and cardigan versus a pullover because I think it's easier to layer. You can throw it over your shoulders. You can tie it in a knot or you can just slip it on over a tee, a tank or a dress. So lots of options there. Couple different really cute versions here that I want to talk about and they're different fits. So kind of different reasons to be. The first is from Every. I'm just going to actually pop this guy back. So can really show you the details of this one. So the first is from Every, incredibly lightweight in this one. So it's not heavy, definitely has some fun fashion detail here. So if you wear cardigans a lot with dresses, this is a really fabulous pairing because it's a little bit shorter. It's gonna hit you right at that waist, give you some nice shape, 
little bit of that puff sleeve and that nice open v-neck really really cute now the other great thing because this sweater is so darn light easy peasy just to do a little throw over the shoulder not think twice about it now you've got your great little sweater just give you a little bit of warmth right try it on i'm seeing someone saying try it on i'll try it on for you let's do it again guys what's so great about this sweater is that it's so lightweight so love that about it i'm just gonna pop it over my head here now when i wear a cardigan with a dress i like to wear it open right i know so many hearts for this so darn cute so i like to wear it open because i think it just helps give you a little bit more shape you can kind of pop it back, right? I've got my pot hands in my pockets. Really, really easy to wear. I also love the idea, though, of how the fact that this cardigan is not so low, you could wear this as a top or just layer it over a tank with a great pair of cutoffs or shorts. We're going to talk about that in a minute. So easy peasy, guys, and just a little bit of fashion, right? So it's not your standard cardigan. Now, on the other end of the spectrum, a really fun way to layer is with what I call the beach cardigan. Now, this is like a little bit more lived in, right? It's a little bit oversized, kind of relaxed. I'm feeling coastal grandmother vibes from this one all day long. So great. So this is from Design History. I love the oversized button on this one. This is definitely meant to be more of a relaxed fit. I'm gonna try this one on so you can see the difference. Really another nice lightweight one. So easy peasy to wear. I think the fashion, this is just different, right? The other version, that great every sweater is a little bit more feminine. I think this guy is just a little bit more beachy, kind of lived in fun, right? So over the dress, easy peasy, keeps you cozy, but look at how fun this is. When we open it up, okay, now it just becomes your great little beach cardigan. I mean, I'm living in Montauk. I'm going to go down to the beach. I'm going to have a fire and roast some marshmallows and glass of rosé. I'm doing my thing, right? So fun. So, so darn cute. Absolutely love this guy. So, and again, little note about this one. So this definitely feels like it's leaning into that coastal grandmother trend that we've been talking about. Yes, you can wear a longer cardigan with cutoffs. Absolutely. There's not really a length rule here. I, like when I'm looking for me, a little bit shorter legs, remember, is it with a cutoff? I'm looking for a sweater that either hits at the length of my cutoff, a little bit above it, or I'm going like full board long where it's like past my cutoff length. So this is a really nice one too. If you like that short cutoff, you want a little bit more coverage on your back side, easy to throw a little sweater on, you're gonna get some of that thigh coverage, which can be so nice, right? Always thinking about that. So easy one from Design History. This guy might be coming home with me today because it just feels like how could you not have a white cardigan in the summer? I mean, so good. Okay, so two easy, lightweight knit cardigans just to get you through. The first from Design History, this guy is the Arley, more of a tunic length, and then the Tatum, it was the Every cardigan that I showed just a minute ago. A little bit shorter length. Okay, let's keep talking layers because then I'm gonna show you maybe your more elevated dress options. So. You've got your nice beachy cardigan sweater, easy to throw on, throw it in your like tote bag, no brainer, right? Sometimes you want something a little bit more structured. That's where, no shock here, your denim jacket comes into play. Everybody needs one in their closet. What is fabulous about a denim jacket is that there's always new kind of details and shapes and silhouettes that are coming out. So let's talk about this great jacket from Paige first. Now, the reason I absolutely love this is much like that shorter cardigan from Everive, this guy is going to give you all the shape in the waist, right? So nice and short, which really, and when I say short, I don't mean cropped. What I just mean is that it's not going to be super long. So if you are a proponent of the dress denim jacket combination, I'm here for it 100%. This is a really great jacket just to pop on, and it's in white, so really, really easy to wear. Also a really good one for petites because it's not such an overwhelming silhouette. Little bit of a puff sleeve. Of course, you know me, I'm always gonna pop the collar on this puppy. And I love that it's tonal, just straight up tonal all the way through and a finished hem. So a little bit more elevated, I would say, on this guy. Easy, easy one to wear. Now, 
If we want to go more cash in our denim jacket, something that maybe feels more like our kind of coastal grandmother great sweater we were talking about from Design History, here's the denim jacket sister to it, another page fab. This guy is the Rowan denim jacket, now a little bit longer, almost in some ways to me this guy feels like a great denim shirt, but a little bit more structure. So if you are a big fan of kind of that casual layer, I've got a great idea for a dress that this look killer over. If you like something that maybe feels a little bit more, I'd say this kind of falls into that like bohemian spirit a bit, a little bit more rock and roll. This is a really, really fun one to have. So I wanted you to see it on because I think it's a little bit easier to understand. You can see it. This is a little bit more relaxed and silhouette, right gang? The sleeves, um, I'm gonna actually unbutton this so you can kind of see how they fit. Full length sleeve, but this is meant to be a little bit more of a relaxed body. So I like this guy, maybe with something a little bit more shaped underneath could be really fun. Um, it's also a great one just to throw over your shoulders. The fabric is soft as can be. If you feel like this is an overwhelming silhouette, my trick always with kind of these more boyfriend fits is to show a little skin. So roll up that sleeve on that jacket. This perfect kind of lived in wash down blue is so fabulous. I love the seaming, so it still does give you some shape, but it's meant to be just a more classic, easy fit. And the details on this guy are so great. I love the washing, so fun. Now, we're thinking about kind of that contrast, right? So I've shown you a couple really easy breezy dresses that go back to these easy breezy sweaters. We've got a little bit more structure with our denim jacket. That's when I pair it back to a dress with just a little bit more structure. We're gonna go from casual to a little more dressed up. So first and foremost, killer dress. So we talked about this guy last week. I had to bring it back because this is that Michael Starr's knit dress. Now, this is kind of the sister to that ruched dress we all love. It is the same silhouette on top as the Nola tank, that great boat neck tank we all adore. It's such a fabulous dress because you can throw it on over a swimsuit. You can wear it kind of dressed up and elevated with a little bit of a wedge or a heel. You can wear it with your Burks. It goes anywhere and because it's a knit, it also is perfect to pack. So just throw it in your bag. Now, the reason I grabbed this one first is because I love the idea of wearing something a little bit more shaped and fitted with an oversized denim jacket on top of it. There's something about that little peekaboo of, a li of kind of that feminine shape underneath something that's a little bit more relaxed that I think is such a fabulous kind of contrast. And you know we're always about that push and pull when it comes to styling. So love this guy. One thing I always call out too, if you're a little afraid of wearing more of a fitted sheath, the great thing about this is it does have that side slit, which I think just gives a little bit more leg and really helps to show off your shape. And again, gang, this is a skim, not a sucking in tight. Show off those curves. There's no better time to do it than right now. It's summer, embrace it. And in this really fun kind of periwinkle and black, easy one to wear. Now, if we're kind of elevating and dressing up a bit, maybe you've got a fun backyard party. There's graduation parties that I know are still going on. Shout out to you, my dear, dear friend, Amy, who is planning her daughter, which I cannot believe her high school graduation party, and I think she's about ready to pull out her hair. You need an easy dress, right? Something you're not gonna sweat in, maybe you're in the backyard, you wanna look like a million bucks, uh, done, I got the dress for you. So what I absolutely adore about this dress from Every, from, well, I mean, where to begin? Number one, this great spaghetti strap. It's adjustable, always important, and this beautiful V-neck. So this is one of those dresses that is so flattering on, it works on a multitude of body types and this great detail of that, I'm gonna tuck that tag in, that elastic on the back really helps to give it fantastic shape. Natural waist with, again, elastic, so it gives you room to kind of play with fit. It has pockets and then of course, it has tiering. Now, partying all day into the night, grab your denim jacket, this makes it feel more casual. Want to elevate it a little bit? This is when I would grab your more feminine white denim jacket. And heck, you can do both for two different parties. Why the heck not? Fantastic maxi dress. Absolutely love this guy. Now talking about our palette, this is like my fun pop of color. 
but you can see there's some really easy neutrals in this, so it kind of works with it, right? So great gold, a little bit of black in here, creams, and a blush pink. So an easy one to wear with any neutral in your closet. If you want something with a little bit more coverage, you might have caught Sharla wearing this, this beautiful, beautiful blush dress. Blush is a neutral, absolutely, why not? This is from Every Eve. What I think is really great about this guy, I'm gonna bring it in so you can see, is the texture. So this is a still kind of hanging into that fun gauze fabrication, but has some beautiful texture to it, so I think it really helps to elevate it. Other details about this that I think are absolutely fantastic. Number one, this beautiful kind of smocking around the neckline. Not only is that a fantastic detail, it also makes the dress fit yeah, perfectly. Cover your arms up a little bit with a great sleeve, not too much volume, but easy volume, and then you're tearing. Now this comes with a self belt. I also love this, and this is how we styled it in the catalog to take it up a notch, swap it out for a leather belt. Now this totally elevates your look. Here's kind of a fun one. I actually love the idea of pairing like a black belt with this. I think it's a little unexpected, could be really fun. Or you can go with something more neutral and your browns or your creams, but it takes it to a slightly different place. I think it feels more feminine and girly when you do the self belt. I think it feels a little bit more dare I say casual and kind of forward when you swap it out with a woven belt. Two looks, one belt, swap, done. And this is a little bit more of a midi length too. So compared to our great yellow maxi, it's a little bit shorter. So if you're looking for something with not quite so much length, this is a great option for you. Okay, so we've talked dresses that you need, right? We've talked the layers that you need. Cardi, you need a great denim jacket, maybe two, right, to get you through and that coverage. Let's kind of maybe take a moment for that pop of fun. Every wardrobe capsule needs it. This is the like unexpected, I got invited at the last minute to a fun party, I just want to look my best, that knock it out of the park look. And one of the things that I think is great about a capsule wardrobe is we're already kind of covering some of our more casual and mm, I'd say like one notch up elevated events. We haven't talked in dresses, but we haven't talked in about those fun wow moments. Instead of a dress, why don't we do a set? So two different options here to talk about. The first I'm going to talk about is this stunner, stunner set. So remember when I said you can go away from your palette in your neutrals if it's like a worthy piece, uh, this totally makes it happen. So we're gonna kind of separate it here and I can show you. So what's so fun about this guy is the halter neckline. I wanna tuck that tag in just because it's kind of distracting. You gotta trust me on this one when I tell you that this is one of those pieces that looks best on. So halter neckline on this guy. So this great cutaway in this beautiful black and cream print. It's adjustable in the back, that neckline with a draw strap, and then you've got this little keyhole back. Absolutely stunning on. And it comes with this more, like to be paired with this more fluid short. Now what I love about this is it's not tight fitting. It's a really easy one to throw on. The short on its own, back to a black tank, no brainer, right? The top on its own, back to like a pair of flare jeans, so sexy, so fun. Or you wear it together, it looks like a beautiful little like romper. So elevated, so fun, so chic. Now, always a question, what shoes do you wear with a shorts set or a romper? And I tend to like to lean into a flatter shoe. That's just, I feel comfortable in that. That feels like kinda my sweet spot there. So that's why I'm wearing today that fun little toe slide sandal. Now, this is an easy one, it comes in multiple colors. I'm wearing the bone, which would be great with this. I also think the black will give it a little pop of elevation and could be a really nice one. So this is that Leanna that we absolutely adore. So comfortable, so easy, because it's 50 bucks. So like minor, minor investment for a shoe that's gonna take you all the places. Pop this guy on, it's so easy and so fun. Now, if you're looking for a little bit of color, and print is not your jam, that's where I grab this amazing, amazing 
kind of a mustardy set. So this is an off the shoulder, one shoulder situation with this really fun short. Again, a pull on short that's got a little bit of volume to it, not too short, easy to pair back to a tank on its own, or even a button down would be so fun. This great statement top that's one shoulder, but so nice, sleeve coverage, tuck this guy in, it becomes a dress. This is another one that I would say I absolutely adore with a flat shoe. Just because of that short, again, that's just how I feel comfortable, but you absolutely can wear this with a wedge. And that to me would elevate it even further. So I just grabbed a fun little wedge here. This is from Vince Camuto. I like the mixing of all the materials on this one. I think that'd be fun and it's not too high. So it's an easy one to kind of walk around and play in. So your set, right? And why we love these sets, of course, is because we can break them apart and mix and match them. All right, so talked about that elevated set. We talked about our dresses. We talked about our layers. Now we need to talk our separates. So first and foremost, you know that I am a huge proponent of the button down. And the reason for this is because you can wear it so many ways. You can wear it as a cover up at the beach. It's a lightweight layer that gives you some nice coverage from the sun, but is still really easy to kind of feel elevated. If you're going into the office, it's a fantastic piece because it's gonna keep you comfortable in air conditioning and help you feel put together. It is one of those pieces in your closet that can do no wrong. So two different ways to do the classic button down here. The first is from Michael Stars. Love this tissue weight. So here's our navy. Bringing in a little bit of color. This is that neutral we're leaning into. What I think is fun about this shirt is all the details. So you've got that great pop layer underneath the collar as well as on the sleeve. You've got this beautiful, beautiful detail here. Just a little bit of gathering to give it some more feminine detail. It's not crazy oversized. This is a just slightly relaxed fit, but not crazy, crazy relaxed. So it's meant to look fun and airy. Now, how to wear this? Mm -hmm. Back to a white pant for the office, back to a cutoff for a casual day over your swimsuit with your like pull on cover up to the beach. Can't go wrong. Now, if you are looking for something that is like the end all be all does all the things, well then you absolutely need your white button down. Now this is so fun. This is from Ronan Ryan. I'm going to bring it in. So what is great about this guy is that little bit of print and pattern, right? You've got this great kind of striping in this material. This guy is called the Lee Shadow Stripe. Now I love this because I think I would wear this shirt over this dress as an alternative to a denim jacket or to a cardigan. So fun, easy one to wear. I also love the idea of tucking this into a short, making it more casual. Simple, simple, no problem solution for a lighter weight layer or to kind of build an outfit. Now, speaking of, I mentioned like the love of a cutoff, right? This is an absolute staple in your closet. I grabbed the A. Goldie Parker because we love, love, love this guy. Now, check it out. Easy outfit right there, right? You can also, of course, wear this back to your fun Michael Stars and you're picking up that gray blue. Tuck it in, leave it out. There's no rules when it comes to these woven shirts now. And why we love the Parker, why it's our number one selling short, why we cannot ever keep this guy in stock is because it flatters so many bodies. More of a vintage wash and feel of this guy, a nice wider leg opening so it doesn't pinch, and kind of a split between a high rise and a mid rise, so really, really comfortable even on hot days. It's not gonna ride you around your tummy. Okay, and then our tops. You need a great tee and you need a great tank. So brand new, just came in from a line. If you're ever gonna trust a t-shirt line, I mean, this is gonna be it, right? This line is called Perfect White Tee. And I gotta tell you, the first thing I ever bought from this brand was a white t-shirt. It is hands down my favorite t-shirt I have ever bought. I have worn it to death. I actually have holes in it, so this is going to be my replacement, no doubt about it. But why are these so great? Number one, the fabric. Light, airy, comfortable, easy. Two, the fit. They are not too tight, not too small. The sleeve, I am a mm, sucker for a good sleeve on a t-shirt. I hate it when they wing out. I hate it when they're too short. I hate it when they're too long. This guy, Goldilocks all day long. It hits you just in the right spot. It's not super flingy. 
really comfortable. I like this the wider banding on the v-neck and that V is not too low. So if you are still leaning down with the kiddos, reaching overhead, doing all the things, so, so easy. Here's in white and then your great classic black. You cannot go wrong. One of the easiest outfits to put together in the summer is a tee, a great cutoff, belt, slide, done, right? You cannot go wrong with this. It is like your formula for success. I always say in summer, I like to update my tea wardrobe, so I will buy more than one. I just get like my black, my white, my gray. Those become my staples, and every summer I refresh because I wear them so much. So this tea from Perfect White Tea, absolutely one of my faves. Now, let's be real, it gets hot, it's hot, it gets hot in the summer, and sometimes you need even less than a tea, you need a tank. So, I like a tank that has a little something going on, just because then it feels like my outfit's a little bit more finished, and I've got one more staple piece you need to kind of pair back. So, this is from Michael Starr's, it's kind of a Michael Starr's home run today, don't you think? This makes sense, they are like the connoisseurs of building wonderful wardrobe pieces. So. This is your fun Henley tank. Now, Henleys are continuing to have a moment. What's nice about these is that it acts like a v-neck tank, but it functions like more of a fashion top. Black, your great white, and then I love a good stripe. Yes, this can go into your capsule wardrobe. It's a nice neutral and easy to wear. So, how to style this guy? Well, of course, you can grab your A Goldie short. Love this guy in a little bit more of that kind of creamy fit. So fun and easy, right? You've got your black tank with your pearl buttons. It feels so put together. Totally different feel when you pair it back to your green. And yes, monochromatic, it can be done. White and cream works together, especially when the buttons are kind of pearlized, really easy. So perfect tank to wear because it has just a little something going on. Grab your denim jacket, grab your cutoffs. So you've got an outfit all put together. Or you can wear your slightly more casual bottom. So that's when we grab this yummy, yummy short from Faraday. I showed you this last when we were talking Faraday. This is such an amazing short. Functions like your not to be named athletic short that you wear all the time, but looks like a fashion short. Comfy, easy, breezy, comes in this great kind of washed on green, as well as in your black. And also a great one to pair back to your tee, throw on your denim jacket good to go so fun just love this right doesn't this just feel like something you live in all summer long but if you want to take that tank and turn it up just a notch sometimes we do that's when a knit skirt and this is kind of a, a surprise piece right comes into play so this is from z supply so the price of course is amazing under 60 bucks this is a sabina knot skirt so why i love this this is your perfect travel companion throw it in your bag Pair it back to your tank, pair it back to your tee, throw on your denim jacket. So, so easy to wear. Why I love this guy, it's got a little bit of that front slit on it, so it shows off your legs, it doesn't feel heavy, elastic waistband, clean body, does not cling, more of a skim fit, true to size for sure on this one, a really, really easy one to wear, right? So, so fun, so easy. Okay, so we've covered all of our wardrobe pieces. From the top, an easy dress, a more in-between elevated dress, right? Sunny, fun to wear to maybe grad parties, backyard barbecues, all of that. You need layers, so a beach cardi, denim jacket. Your bottoms category, you need a fun little short, you need a cutoff, and for a fun unexpected twist, a great knit skirt. For tops, everybody needs a button down. It is your summer essential piece. You're gonna mix and match it a million ways. It's so easy to wear, both as to the beach as well as out to dinner. Surprise, surprise, your unexpected fun piece. This is your set that you're gonna dress up and break apart and wear out to dinner. I mean, take that little one shoulder top and pair it with your Parker Longs. How cute would that be? So this is your fun piece that just wow factor in that closet and then your essential tea, your essential tank. Done. All right, all we have left before we wrap are those great accessories. So you need a bag and you probably need more than one. I always like joke about this, I call this my handbag wardrobe. I was actually talking about this with Megan Tampy, our CEO yesterday. 
you need more than one. So I'm going to grab two because I think the, what's so great about these is how they kind of mix and match. So first, our tote from V Collective. I have sung the praises of this. I love it in this khaki color. It is so lightweight. You can wear it as a crossbody. This is a beach bag. This is a travel bag. This is a mom bag. This is a get it done bag. This is a do all the things bag. Love, love, love this guy. Now, sometimes you need something smaller. That's where I go to. This awesome, awesome crossbody. Another really fun one. I think the shape on this, I'm not gonna wear two bags. That looks absolutely insane and you guys are gonna think I'm nuts. So, okay, what's so great about this guy is that I think the shape is fantastic. If you're gonna have a hands-free bag, make it hands-free and make it easy. So easy to reach in here, grab your things. I would say this is big enough for wallet, sunglasses, keys, Maybe your like lipstick, chapstick, depending on like what your end destination is. Wear it as a crossbody, or you can adjust the belt and wear it as a belt bag. Both so cute. I love how this mixes and matches even with this dress. And a fun secret about belt bags: if you're wearing a shift and you feel like it's too casual or not body defining enough, belt bags totally do the trick. They help break it up either this way or around your waist, give you a little bit of shape. So fun and so easy. Okay, we talked about the shoe. We've got our Leanna, comes in multiple colors. I encourage you to buy more than one because you're gonna wear it to death. And then you just need that one slightly elevated shoe. I showed you that great option from Vince Camuto. More of a wedge. I love this guy, a little bit more delicate. If you wanna do something more in that kind of boho family, then I would do this great little suede club. Still really lightweight, easy to wear with any of the dresses I've shown totally changes the spirit of the look, right? So check it out. I got my Leanna on one foot. I'm gonna put this great little suede clog on the other. It kind of takes it up a notch, right? Really fun and really easy. Can't go wrong with either one. Whew, okay, I did all the work there for you. We got that capsule wardrobe put together in a flash. Now all you need to do is, you know, assemble it and then live your life and have so much fun this summer. My daughter's new phrase is, live what you love. She says it all the time. Just, I'm just living what I love, Mom. Just living what I love, Mom. And I'm kind of, I don't know, I'm kind of into it. I'm like, I'm going to take that mantra and run with it this summer. So make it easy on yourself. Build that wardrobe closet. So fun. Get that capsule going. And we will see you next week. Take care, everybody.